So we're in a major drought in Texas right now. Everything is dried up. Uh, the corn harvest is over. Wheat's been gone for a while. Uh, it's 105, 106, 107 degrees, no rain. Pigs can't dig. So man, they're just holing up in the shade, staying in the thickets. So you can't really sit in the fields and wait for them to come out. You gotta go in after them. So we're doing a lot of walking around, a lot of stalking, trying to spot some pigs. And uh, man, they're back in the thick stuff. But finally, we spot some pigs. All right, got a big group of hogs. Uh, they're over here in the trees. Kind of moving back to the north. And I'm hoping they'll come back down this creek line. So kind of set up in a good spot. We'll see if they come at us and I can shoot one in the face. This may be the hottest hunt that I've been on in my life, or at least since I've been to Africa. There's nothing you can do about the heat and there's no use complaining. Just thank God that it's not snowing. Can you imagine having to shovel snow in this heat? So we move in really, really, really slow. And about that time, the pigs get up and start to move. They're moving from right to left. I'll tell you what, a pig gives me a shot. This light colored show is running right at me, has no idea we're there, and uh, I can't swing my gun around. I'm gonna try to swing the gun around and, and the tree's in the way, and it happens so fast. Um, I've watched a lot of Chuck Norris movies and Steven Seagal and uh, Jean-Claude Van Damme, and um, I feel like I pretty much know how to kick a pig, but uh, luckily for the pig, he turned at the last second and ran the other way. Anyway, got one down, so I'm gonna have some uh, happy construction workers. Well, 6.5 Grendel will put them down. That's a perfect size little gilt for eating, so I'm pretty happy with her. So I got a nice size little pig down. Time to go drop it off to the boys. <laughs> 